That, that Resident Evil. Oh, that shit looks scary. Oh, I'm frightened. Hey, everybody. Oh! Welcome to uh, the Festival of Frights. Shit's spooky. Oh, oh, look how scary that is. Ooh, it's a slug or something. Oh, hey, it's a body bag. Have you ever, yeah, it's, it's a bad body bag. Have you, uh, you've, have you played this game before? I've never played a Resident Evil game. I th I, I own I, a copy of Biohazard 2. It's it's hard for me to gauge whether or not you'd like the series or not. Also, everyone say hi to Tony. Hey everybody. We just record we just finished recording uh Skyward Sword actually. So we're kind of right off the rails with that. This is my first uh Festival of Frights appearance despite this being a 3-year thing. I must create a new save data. Let's do it. Create a, a new one. Not an so old this game one. is free for the month of October on the PlayStation Network store. It's it's weird considering it's October and it's this game and Transformers and Transformers is not like have a horror theme to it at all. Resident yeah, it's like it's Transformers. That's that's totally fine. I I love I love that I a concept of like fuck that just have one horror game and one game that's com the complete opposite. I'm gonna, I'm gonna assume all this looks good. I, oh fuck! It looks fine. Looks like a video game. I like climbing a mountain. I like going on a hike. I like taking a walk. I like all of those things actually. I do too. I, I am a faggot for hiking. I'm gonna go on a hike. Cause I ain't no pussy. But I'm also a total pussy. Oh, should we should we should we be Cross or Joel? Who? Cross or Joel? Be Jill. Don't be an idiot. Be Joel. Oh boy, look at that. Fuck, that looks good. I don't know. I'd say it should outfits? be Jill. Huh? Are they just different outfits for them? Yeah. Huh? Because you know which, HD which versions. Which Jill should I be? Either or. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be classic Jill. Go for it. Do your thing. I like the classic Jill skin. I like Jilling off. <sighs> this is my first and last appearance on the Festival <laughs> of Frights. I hope you guys enjoyed my presence. Ooh, last. <laughs> Yeah, pretty much. Alpha team is flying around July 1998, forest, Raccoon Forest. In Northwest Raccoon City, where we are Raccoon Forest? For of our compatriots, or Robert City? Team. Forest. Resident Evil 1 takes place in a mansion in a forest. You, you, you said that as if the subtitle said forest, and it definitely did not say forest. Also, no, I love that they said forest before they said city. Okay. So right now they're above the forest. Victims oh yeah, I forgot. I can't hear a single word coming from the game. The Bravo team was sent. Bravo team was sent in to investigate because the Alpha contact. team was a bunch of fucking idiots. But we lost contact. Bravo team's helicopter. Get on the point. Oh, what's up, Joseph? Joseph Christ. Save for the remaining body of. For the body of. Yeah, I'm. I'm very curious how you'll. Uh, because you've never played Resident Evil before, how you like this game? Like I've seen people play Continue Resident Evil games. For the other members. Probably four. I might, I might and like it, it. Into or some of them at least. Yeah, I mean they're they're interesting for considering the time that they came out, where it was just horror games like this didn't really exist. I'm really sad that uh, this version doesn't have the really. <laughs> Shitty fucking live action intro for the characters. Right. Well, they they fucking they knew. It's Editing fine. me. Throw in that fucking clip just right right in the front here. Yeah. We don't know where Barry is. 
Chris Redfield. Gerald Valentine. Barry Burton. Rebecca Chambers. Albert Wesker. Biohazard. Good shit. But, I mean... Maybe this... I haven't, I haven't played the HD version yet. Also, I haven't touched the first Resident Evil in a while. I've played four a bunch of times. I play at least once or twice a year. But also, I'm biased and like the game a lot. Did Joseph just fucking die. No, he's fine. Yeah, I love Joseph. Don't do that. You love Joseph Stalin. You love him. Those pumbles are just hungry. Should've just given him a ham. Give him a ham job. Give him a ham job. Him yeah. Fuck some ham. Fucking Christ. Top three anime deaths, Joseph. <laughs> Joseph Joestar. Come on! <laughs> oh man. I mean I should have made the fucking intro have uh Part four's opening theme song. That would Which fucking one? the first one. Crazy noisy bizarre town. Yeah. Boy. That that would have fit well, I think. No, <laughs> <laughs> the first one for Yeah, absolutely. Lord. <laughs> I know. Listen, I am a horror fan. I know exactly what I'm talking about. Yeah. You're also incredibly wasted. Am I? Are you? Let me find out. Let me take more three more drinks to this. <laughs> enter the survival horror. Dude, we're about to enter survival horror. Are we? Fuck. There are only three stars. Left now. Captain Wesker, Barry, and myself. And myself. Man, this game looks pretty. Holy shit. I haven't seen the HD version yet in a while. What is this place? Look at the fucking G.I. Joe in the Not back. You were almost a Jill sandwich. Sure. We're all soldiers now. Whisker, where's Chris? Jill, no. Jill, no. Have... Don't search for don't Chris. I'm evil. There. Don't <laughs> Yeah. Find... Pretty much. What was that? I have my Reaper and uh, Soldier 76 no. voice down almost to a T. Yeah. Yeah. I'm doing going with her. God's work. Thank you. Chris and I go back a long Fly way. like an Egyptian. All right. That wasn't either of them. That was Farah. I'll secure this area. <laughs> she doesn't even say. Oh, does she say fly like an Egyptian? Yes. She does. <laughs> she says it a lot. Flying the safe skies. Flying the friendly skies. Actually. Friendly skies. Same shit. You're cl you're close. It's fine. Close you don't play Farah, so it's. I play right. sometimes. Some. Man, welcome to this episode of Festival of Frights, where we're just not talking about scary shit at all. Overwatch is scary. When you get a bad team and you just start screaming. You you get so fucking... Oh, yeah. Okay. We're playing it. We're in Pink there. Pink Ribbon! Yo, we can yes. save the game now. Yep. That's the Game's one over. thing I don't like about Resident Evil, is you have limited saves. It's fine. What did that say? When the two have run each other through, the path to your destiny will open. I wonder what it could mean. I think you'd better take a look at this. What is blood. It? Hope it's not Chris's blood. Mm. Blood. Jill. He doesn't even say I hope it's not Chris's blood. What the fuck? This version sucks. Hmm. Let's just hope it's fine. Oh, there it is. You said it better. I take it back. I, I, I wonder. Like I said, I haven't played this version yet, so I wonder how much fucking difference there actually oh. is. Oh, there's there's aim to shoot. Okay. Aim shoot. There's aim shoot. That's a weird phrase to say. I said aim to shoot. Oh, I least the aim shoot. No. Here's aim shoot. Here's aim shoot. I'd love to aim shoot. What's over here? Death.
can I get a little privacy? So, I'm I'm weird about zombies in general as like a horror mechanic. Like I th I think this game is very good, but I don't think it's I don't think it's a good horror game. Yeah. How do how do you feel about like zombies being used? Zombies as, like... fucking terrify me. Really? What is it? I have an unnatural fear of the dead. I, I think the concept of them is good, but I think it's been it. overused a little too much. It has been, but I still like am absolutely terrified of the thought of the dead coming back to life. Oh, totally. I actually like I walk what by cemetery like when we go this? by cemeteries, I end up holding my breath and I get freaked out every single time thing. without fail. Let's report this huh. I just do not like graveyards. I do not like the dead. I like none none of that shit. That makes sense. I mean, it it it's unnerving a little bit. There she okay. But also you have to think about like, this is life. <laughs> you're gonna be like this life. one day. You're gonna be like this one day. Get ready. <laughs> but it's there. But I, I think the con like concept overall of using zombies as a horror mechanic is kind of like with Metal Gear Survival. Like I'm sure the game's gonna be fucking really good. I'm sure but everyone like, would agree that it would be better if it wasn't called fucking Metal Gear. Wesker. I th yeah. Even if it's that like too. an alternate dimension thing, it's like it's, no one cares. Just don't call it Metal Gear. Call it something else. Well, I, th but. I think there's gonna be a store mechanic based off, based off of it because of the way Metal Gear Solid Five worked out, which you still need to play to actually figure out why it might make sense. Because I'm not gonna spoil it for you. What about Resident Evil Five? No, I mean uh, Metal Gear Solid Five. Sorry, oh. did I say Resident Evil? That was my bad. I thought I thought you did. I might have misheard you. I probably did, but uh, like I said, I'm also very drunk, so who knows. Um, but there's like sp very specific story elements in Mega Solid Five that might make sense for a survival, or Mega Gear Survive, whatever the fuck it's called. No, nothing. What's going on? That guy has a fucking figure it out. Don't Barry's make cry character. fucking pistol. Huh? Oscar. Barry's the best there's character. Much we can do. Yeah. We can search for him separately. Nah, Jill's better. I love Jill. Okay, then. I'll try the Barry's the great, side. though. <sighs> this mansion is gigantic. Is he? He's pretty good. I think they brought him back in, like, the first floor. one of the Resident okay. Evil games, or, like, a side game oh. or something. They usually bring back old Him characters. And his daughter. They, they hardly... They never use Barry until, like, I think... Sex. ...a multiplayer thing, and then, like, an actual game where it was him and his daughter. I may need it. Listen, I want to say it was six. Happens, six or five. I played like the first like hour or five and got really bored of it. That's all I remember. Five I remember. doesn't seem like it's very good. My experience was five was... But then there's a lot of people who were like, five is amazing. I don't know if I may have played the demo of it, but like I remember playing it and being stuck in a fucking shack and being like surrounded by 300 zombies and being like, this is not horror, this is just bullshit. But anyway, I, anyway. I, I love, I really like this game. I have I'm, no I'm not going to tell you anything about how to play it. I'm just going to let you do it. Like, I but, don't know I mean, anything about, like, where to go and what to do. I just know there's zombies around somewhere. Even, even after you're done recording this, I think you should actually, like, follow through and, like, go back to that fucking, hold on, go back to that first area. Like, just, like, the camera placement of everything is so fucking good. The, like, the almost cinematography of this game is just perfect. Handgun magazine, yes, I want that. Yes, I would take that. Uh, herbs, yes, I'll smoke herbs. that. Herbs. Got smoked it. Smoke that herb. Smoke that green. I like how it's called green herb, too. They knew. They knew. They always know. I remember one thing about this version of the game, and it's that uh, it's like the zombies weed. will come back up to life if you don't blow their heads off, and they'll become like scarlet heads, and they'll be faster and stronger or some shit. Scarlet heads? Yeah, that's a good way to put it. That's that's what they're called, scarlet heads. <laughs> that's a scary name for something, by the way. Let 
Man, this is, this fucking HD version looks really good. Ooh, there's a Zambambo over here. I I, I wonder if they still have uh, implemented like pre-rendered backgrounds. Got him. Got him. Got him. Got him. I didn't get him. Get off, you fucking get loser. I'm not a fan of the camera angles that much. Is he? Really? I yeah, and I it, uh, for your first time playing this game, it might be a little like off-putting just because of the way video games are now. Bam. First kills are special. Bam. I remember like they're not dead if they land on the ground and there's no blood. I remember that tidbit like of information. Like most murders. Yes, I will take that golden arrow. On the status screen, select an item and click examine. Alright. There's some handgun ammo. Sick. Yeah. Man, I don't remember that there being that much ammo in this game. There probably wasn't, like, in the original, but then they, like, changed it. Because people were like, oh, there's not enough ammo. Yeah. Well, this is, like, the third fucking release of this game, so... I don't think I need those herbs yet. Just keep them there for safety. No, you don't. Need, you don't need them yet. Yet, though. I mean, the doors. The doors fucking freak me out the most about some of this shit. Oh, I love the doors. Cause it's like, I'm just waiting for the day where like you open the door and it's like, hey, there's a zombie directly there. It's like, oh god. What's the um? There's one game that's like this. I actually think Pro Jared reviewed the um. Xbox 360 version. Uh, Alone in the Dark. That's it. Oh, I think that's it. Did I just kill myself? Yeah, you. No. Yeah, I think you did. <laughs> yeah. Um, I'm fairly certain I just did. Put it back. Put it back! How do I open my inventory? There. Like that. Put it back in. There's a game called uh, Alone in the Dark. Yeah. I don't know if you've ever played it. I've heard of it. It's exactly like this concept of like a fixed camera angles and just shit like that. And I've never played it personally. I've always wanted to play the DOS version because the DOS version looks fucking bonkers. Fuck you, buddy. I hope it just turns on in front of you. I don't know how to get that key. Which one? The one that I just picked up, that this thing came out for me. Like, that thing just, like, came out and started trying to kill me. Because I tried to take the key. Um. I'm not sure. An emblem of a helmet. I have a very, a very good habit of yawning mid sentence, so I'm very sorry. I definitely said I'm not sure and it came out I was like I'm I, not sure I thought I could like run down here and like there was another corridor here but there isn't and that that only exists when you fucking so oh well it this this game is very experimental you need to spend like an actual couple hours playing it like it's it's not it's not very handholdy at all I know that much actually like I said even after recording this for Festival of Frights, you should still like sit down and play it. It's a very enjoyable game. It doesn't age well in some regards with like the fixed camera angle stuff. Like I know, I, I like it personally, but some people don't like it. I mean, like the camera angles are nice and shit. Like they look good, but it's like when it constantly like, changes like that, and it's like, okay, which way do I head? And then you move the control right. in the way you think is right, and it's not right. It's a little confusing in that regard. It's it's because it's in a tight space. It's not very uh, open worldy. I remember there being a point in this game. Oh hey, buddy! How'd I miss Hello. you? Nope. Fuck you! Don't touch me! Go away! Uh, where, where, where are you turning, Jill? Jill, please. So on a scale of uh one to fucking uh. Zombie, how scary is this? Um, like a, I'm like not as scared 
as this as I was with zombie. I I I because you just put zombie up like yesterday, right? Yeah. Zombies are uh, pretty fucking intense. I didn't realize how tense it was. Okay, he's dead. Yeah, it's it's pretty fucking tense. I, I'm I have a a I've I've always had a bad experience with uh just games in general with trying to sneak around because there's always that low key like fuck I need to be quiet as possible and not get noticed and if I get noticed I want to have a heart attack like even with Mega Solid Five like fuck I I'm so bad at sneaking. Who lad? Like these are good at camera angles and shit, but I'm like, boy howdy, this isn't a place I look yeah, like I want to go to at all ever. Yeah, it. Like I said. But I mean, I guess that's the it's, point. It's 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 a very different game. And yeah, that's kind of the point. I, I think it's just because this game takes place in a mansion. Yeah. And it's trying to be. Like if this game had fucking like actual camera angles, it would be impossible to find a good angle with going around a corner. Well, hey, it's a Hylian shield. Now I can defend myself. Anyway. Yeah. I think I have to put that in one of those doors back there. I'm gonna have to save this. Yeah, it's like a puzzle. Huh. Uh -huh. Also, like I, I very much love the fact of like using like equipment or anything for safe states. Yeah. Like I, I know in Mother 3 like trying to save you have to use a frog. Yeah. Or something. I, I, I love that concept. I love like it's having so save points good. like that. Especially when I mean, they're like a, a thing and not just like a shining thing on the ground. Yeah it's just like a basic ass thing. Now granted like Nowadays, you should be able to save like whenever the fuck you want to. But look at that shot. That's so fucking good. Boy, I don't know. Boy, howdy. What? I just heard like that. <laughs> and I was like, oh boy, boy. I I don't want to be there. No, it's it's a rough time. Ooh. What's going on in this thread? I ask that myself every time I go on Twitter. Woman drawing water. She's not drawing water. She's holding it, you fucking idiot. Here I am. <laughs> Video games, man. They're fucking Get great. Down from there, you silly fucking idiot. Push it. There you go. Yeah. What's back here? Is it Zambambolines? No. It's a nope. sword. It's a dagger. These not defense a sword. items such as daggers will allow you to escape momentarily when grabbed by an enemy. The equip it. Go to the status screen. All right. Yeah, think of like all the actual like horror games that you're playing this month. This is very. This is going to be very much like the most like low key one. It's. But it's still a good game regardless. Yeah. Oh! Ah. That fucking freaked me out, actually. Did it? A little bit, yeah. That got me pretty fucking good. Just the sudden, like, loss of control. L2, stab him. There you go. Can I get, can I get, can I get that back? No. Nope. Are you dead? Various art supplies. I, mean, I guess he's dead. Yeah, I, the pool of blood. I think he comes back, actually. I'm just gonna yeah, just push this back over there. Yeah, just do that. Huh? <laughs> yeah, later, asshole. <laughs> it's locked. I don't know if a sword is carved in. I know there's something shiny in her thing. Do I have to shoot that? Uh, I think so. Let's find out. Yeah. Nope. Not doesn't look like Can it. Can you hit it? Can I reload? Do I have a reload button? There it is. 
How much ammo do I have? I have not a lot. No, it's. Well, that's what I was saying earlier about like. It's all about ammo conservation more. and. Uh, I say yes, after I wasted so. like three bullets on that statue. Resident Evil's neat. What's that? The Resident Evil's neat. That's one thing I think I could always say about the Resident Evil is that it's a very neat series. Oh, yeah. It's uh it's interesting. Considering how this one went from what it is now to now with seven coming out where it's VR. Can I blow your head off? It's uh it's a very star from the bottom now we here but also here might be worse than one a little bit of armor oh god this is the one with the fucking shield isn't it no I don't think so emblem of a sword where the fuck is the shield one then I don't know. I ain't going to tell you. Welcome to the point of Resident Evil. Oh God. <laughs> this is another thing. I'm not very smart. Nobody is. <laughs> let's be let's let's be super real. So I'm just like walking and, uh, around with the fucking tur like a turkey with its head lopped off. No, it, it's the point of this game is that is to look around and shit. It's. Despite it looking linear, you're, you know, you're encouraged to explore a bit. That was one of the main issues I had with the, Resident, the later Resident Evils was how linear it was, almost, in a sense. But with it's very much like, you're in a mansion, fuck around, do whatever. Yeah, this one's just like, hey, you want to just walk around, check some things out? Do you want to look around? Go for it. Just fucking do whatever. It's not like... <sighs> Man, I had such a bad experience with 5 and 6. Like, it's so weird. But, anyway. Ah. I unlocked it. Yeah. Good job. But, I, yeah. it. This, this whole series is very hit and miss for, for people. Give me that dagger. Also, I love how that camera goes. It's like, here's this fucking zombie just kind of. Yeah, here's the Zambo <laughs> right stumbling towards you. Yeah. Where's he at? It's daunting. It's. it's this game Ooh, can I have found moments him. of Ooh, like. I found him. Yeah. Gross. Also, yeah, you do not kill him. There you go. Ah, I was hoping I could get it off on him, like, right then. But no. Nope. I need to eat this. Dude. Nope. Can you not, nope. like, immediately grab me, sir? Fuck. I think uh, another reason why I like this game so much is because they're, they're very low-key about the zombies. Like, they exist, obviously, Jill. in Jill. bunches, but it's not. Joe, please. Smoke there you go. that stupid. Hey, there's a blue. I wonder if that's important. Probably not. I can't reach it. Is there any more things on the side that I should be aware of? What's that? I was looking to see if there's any more like little items on the side or something. Oh, uh, I'm not. I'm not going to tell you. I know this you're is, not. You're fucking. This is your. Shit. <laughs> What's in here? Imagine you open one of these doors. And it's just Wesker sitting in a fucking chair, like button naked. That was the sentence I was expecting you to say. He's just like totally naked. He's just like I've been waiting, Jill. She's like. There, there's zombies trying to kill us. 
What are you doing? Hmm. That's kind of Resident Evil I'd play. That's the kind of anything you'd play. That's true. An emblem of armor. Fucking. I guess that leads to that one hallway then. Which one? You know the one. Do I? Yeah. Yes. Oh, this is above Forever. the fucking dining room, isn't it? Yeah. I think so. Yeah. Yeah. Can I just jump down there? Oh, man, that would have been funny as shit. Nope. I think there's a door that I didn't go through back here. Yeah, because I came through that one. And it's locked. Okay. Yeah, like... Ugh, this game's weird. It's, it's very not modern. And very open-ended. In terms of, like... How you go about, like, finding shit out. But, like... You're, if you do actually sit down and play this after the Festival of Frights is over or whatever, like you're you're gonna have to spend a decent amount of time playing it. Yeah, that's 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 the outside, all right. Look, like this game looks fucking really nice. It does. God it damn. looks very good. As it's, it should. It's very old school. It's very old school I don't looking. Know more healings, right? No, I don't. Hello? But... Did I just take off my sw my? Yeah, I did. Okay. Equip that gun again. Is there anything in this main room that I missed? I have no idea. Nope. Uh, no, I think nope. you're good. A Chinese urn. What if I try to open this door? That happens. Nope. Don't do that. That happens. <laughs> Just escape your problems. Don't don't face them head on. Just escape them. Remember, kids, when a zombie Doberman's trying to eat your face, just run away from it. Remember that for when uh, zombie Dobermans become a reality. Just rampant. Yeah, become a reality. Lord, I think that's going to do it for this. I mean, Man. yeah, it's, 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 I, I very much enjoy this game. It is not a horror game in the traditional sense. Like it is like with like most of them where it's like, there's jump scares all over the place and it's whatever. It's very much a survival horror. Survivor horror. Horror? Horror. 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 But, I mean, if you're watching this, you should definitely download and play it. I enjoy this game a lot. Get it while it's free. Get it while it's free. It's... Or pay money for it. I mean, either way.